ladies and gentlemen. This is what I came to see, mate. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Hope everyone's doing blessed. Today, Netflix, Zack Snyder, they've dropped Rebel Moon Part 2. Now, I do want to say a few things regarding number one. Uh, first of all, I didn't react to number one, if I'm being totally honest. I was so extremely busy that day. I had another show to cover and two movies. It was insane. I was so busy and I remember doing it on the next day and I just did a review. But you guys let me know straight up. That was a massive L and today we're going to rectify it and we're going to watch part two together. Now, if you want my feelings on part one, I'm going to be real. I am a mega Zack Snyder fan. His Justice League is 10 out of 10 god tier for me. Dawn of the Dead is 9 out of 10. It's one of my favourite horror movies ever. And it is my favourite zombie movie ever. Watchmen is a 9.5 out of 10 movie for me. I'm a big fan. I've been a fan of him for a long time. And I even liked Army of the Dead. I gave that 8 out of 10. I'm a big fan of Zack Snyder. But, 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 but. I will say it now. If you're new. For me, yeah. A dead average movie is 5 out of 10. That means I didn't love it. I definitely didn't hate it but I probably won't watch it again. It's right in the middle. I'm on the fence, man. I gave part one, to the best of my knowledge, I have re-watched it, so this is a kind of a newer take. I gave it 4.5 out of 10, which isn't bad, but it is in the realm for me of being a little bit disappointing. I expected so much. However, I said in my review, the part two could fuse together, Dragon Ball style, mate. It could make the whole thing better. So there's a lot for me there's a lot riding on this part too, man. If you're a fan, sorry for this long ass intro, if you enjoyed it, you're a fan of Zack Snyder, or you just appreciate the reaction, then do me a massive solid favour, bruv. Smash the like button, I will greatly appreciate it. While you're down there, if you want to join the Nerd Army, that'd be sick. As always, huge mad love and respect to everyone supporting your boy on Patreon. You guys are amazing. And now, let's, let's hope this is a banger. Let's go, man. Was the small moon of Velt. There, a Velt. village of By humble way, farmers. That dude, yeah. The robot, the guy who can shoot people without even looking, he better do something amazing. I'm just saying, like, we need it, mate. They were joined by the mighty Tarak in the minds of Dagus, the fierce nemesis, in the Colosseum of Pollux, the wayward general Damn, Titus, wait. and on the planet Charan, Darian Bloodax, and his lieutenant Melius. Jesus. In an ambush on the floating docks of Gondaval, Cora triumphed over Admiral Noble, leaving his... Bro, there's a lot of stuff he said. He ain't stopping. His warriors returned to Velt to collect their pay. Yeah. The threat of a dreadnought extinguished. Brother. That was an intro, boy. Or so they believed. That is what you call an intro dialogue, monologue. All the logs, all in one breath. Yeah. <laughs> He had no brain function for quite a while. Mm. We don't know how bad the damage was. I'm trying to bring my man back from the dead. Because obviously he didn't get ruined at the end. I'm get. I was going to say, spoiler alert, I'm guessing you see part one if you're here, you know what I mean? Get that blue juice inside him, mate. <laughs> yeah. There was a clear. He was kind of dead in episode one, part one. Hopefully he does some badass stuff for this one, man. Listen to me. She's on fat. Mm. Who? He wants revenge. Quick time, innit? Yes. <coughs> the scar giver. Scar giver. She's on felt. No, man's on revenge. This is a cause for felt. This got potential, man. Please. We have prepared food and drink for you in the longhouse. Yeah, mate. Come He's on. still got that weird, we'll like, what... camera thing going on. I don't know what that's called. Just that fish thing, man. Like, do you know what I mean? In the last scene, then. All is on target. Nothing out of the ordinary. No, sir. Very well. Ensure that the harvest is brought in as planned and ready for our arrival in five days' mm. time. Yeah, they're coming back to get them goods, baby. You know what I mean? There he is. The baddest man in the movie who didn't do anything. Well, he did one thing, I guess. His character design is well sick. Uh, you can't knock that, mate. I really hope he does some sick stuff, man. Please, bruh. To return to the mother world at once. Then we owe you an even deeper yes. debt of... Breaking. You're wrong. <laughs> yep, I just go. received word. On the way, baby. They'll be here in five days. 
Bro, this could be pure action. And do you know what? It could really, like, help the overall score for me, man. Did kill him. His body was smashed on the rocks. He is dead. It's against protocol to come with our admiral to command the ship, right? That is true. But mm. death is not always deterrent true. enough for the designers of the mother world. There must mm. be more in need of this grain than we could have known. Yeah, they just stuck that blue gel in my man. Brought him back. Easy life. Manya is about to deliver that speech. Dark days lie ahead yep. of us all. Yep. When the time comes, we may all have to stand together in battle as brothers. Yeah, do you know what? I'd probably go to battle if he was giving that speech with that voice breath. <laughs> no, it must be done in three days' time. What? No we need every man and woman who's able. The brain is our most powerful weapon. Without it, yeah. they are liable to blow us out of existence from orbit. If we bring Damn. it in fast, All right. we can use it both as bartering tool and shield. Okay, cool. They're already coming up with a plan. Solid. By the way, the girl with like the laser sword, I can't remember her name, but uh, I want to see her. Do you know what I mean? She needs to get some more screen time with that bad boy lightsaber, mate. The most afraid I've ever been in my life. What was it you were so afraid of? If it wasn't that? It was you. Mm. It was losing you. No, oh, just kiss already, man. <laughs> Yay! Kissy time! I know what's up. It's symbolic I can't to an deny, yeah. Say what you want about the movie. The visuals look sick. They just do. Zack Snyder knows how to make something look sick. He had told me the princess must die. And die she would. Damn. There is a lot of monologue in this movie so far, man. This obviously is obviously going to be way condensed for YouTube, but there's a lot. A lot of slow-mo, which is, I guess, everyone knows what's up with that. I had faith that Belisarius would protect me and the Empire he so loved. This is cool. Bit of backstory, like that. Something's wrong. Belisarius. Where is the Kali? Why, why aren't the furnaces lit? Where's the furnaces? Yes. <laughs> Answer me, man! Man's getting blanked. They're about to, yeah, chef him up real quick, innit? Oh, they actually are playing the violin. I thought it was just music overlay, innit? <laughs> Surely she ain't escaping that. There's no way. Woo! Yeah, 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 I mean, man. At least he tried, bro. I am actually low key looking forward to the director's cut if it's actually happening. This is rated 12, PG 13 in US, whatever. Love to see rated R. Rated M. Do you know what I mean? Apparently it's coming. I'm looking forward to that because these scenes with like blood and gore would slap a little bit different, man. Kill her! No! <laughs> no I forgive you. Ooh. Don't. Oh. It's low key, kind of deep, a little bit, yeah. They're all dead. Proper dead. Again, this would be sick if it was rated R, man. Do you know what I mean? The cancer of ethnic impurity. Madeline! What a slime ball, man. They're like animals, man. Yeah, sort him out, man. Yeah. See, there was a little bit there where she like went like that, and it, the camera cut away just as she, like my man's got his head blown off. Rated R, man. Would have slapped. I say would have slapped. It probably will slap if it comes out. If it's real, I'm just here rumors, man. Right, wake up, stop digging, or do whatever you got to do to get the crops going. Let's go. 
He loves slow mo. He loves it more than anyone on the planet, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know if this is nice or not. I, it's kind of giving me like some farm simulated thing. I don't know, man. It's you know, even worse. I can show it, but I can't play it. There's music playing over it, and it will get copyright claim for YouTube, and you'll never see it anyway. But even the music can't save it. This is just weird, man. Like I don't know. <laughs> just sit down here now. On my way. He's losing his marbles, mate. There are protocols before you can be cleared to resume command. Tests that need to be conducted to see if you are mentally and physically strong. I don't think he's mentally cool at all, bruv. Ooh, he's physically alright. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. The camera angles is always pretty sick, man. Take these stupid wires off. Let's do this. A few days. I don't know what I did. When I deliver her to Belisarius and her body is displayed in the rotunda of the Senate, I shall bear my chest. Mm. And it will stand as a symbol that it is I who brought to justice the scar giver. Alright, brother, you got a second chance to take her down, you know what I mean? Let's do something, innit? We're back to the um, farming simulator. Do you know what's mad? Like, they're gonna get all these crops ready. But is it my man just gonna blast them down anyway? Because he's after her, so I don't know if it's even a fucking waste of time, brother. We got the most slow mo I've ever seen. Brav, <laughs> it's Zack Snyder. I respect it, man. You love it? <laughs> I think, yeah. I don't keep saying it. I think I've seen more slow mo in this section. Than most entire movies, if they even if they use slow mo, do you know what I mean? Damn, we're still going with this thing, man. They, they better hope the crops save them. We're spending a lot of screen time with them. I'll probably have to like, well, I will be cutting a lot of this out of YouTube, so the video's not stupidly long. But trust me when I say that was a solid six, seven minutes of crops. <laughs> Maybe some mercies in order. These dogs deserve nothing but our boot. Is that right? We'll see when the job is done. For the slain king. No, slain king. Big up. The scar givers among them. So it yeah, seems our young private saying. has chosen a side. Mm, they clocked him out. He's a good guy in episode one, part one, whatever. But, um, that's what I mean. They're going to go there for the crops, but sh he knows she's there, so aren't they just going to nuke them all anyway? Like, what? Strong and unmoving. Oh, yeah, lovely, great. Thank you. Cool. They've got time to make presents. But your nobility is undeniable. Like the snow elk, warming us and bringing us comfort. Oh, they've all got little blankets, little quilts. Nemesis. Gotta be the, the best name ever on it. You are right, he better do something this episode, yeah? Part one. No. He's just staring, chilling with that crown on. And he had the best scene in part one, didn't it? Where he's looking here and he just blasts that guy. It was, it was actually proper sick, so th that's what he was doing. That, that right there is what he was doing at the end of part one. Just nothing. Just chilling. Yeah, you lot deal with it, man. We've got ourselves a meeting, ladies and gentlemen. A plan. Today we begin the preparation for our defense. We start by moving the grain into the village so they can't shoot us from orbit without risking its destruction. All right. Do you know what? Low key, that kind of makes sense if it's that like precious to them, which they made it clear it is. Armor piercing, high explosive detonators. Got some comms. <laughs> Mate, they conveniently left bear stuff in part one, didn't it? Gather and account for every hunting rifle, every knife, right. every round of ammunition in the village. Do you know what? Yeah, they're building it up. This final battle could be so sick. Two seasons. Go. The ship core was. There's a lot of 
A lot of prep happening now. We could pull it out. It could be a powerful asset. There is a lot of planning. And my man, they're just watching. Hold on. We've got power, baby. Yeah, the visuals are very good, man. Zack Snyder knows what he's doing. You're all here because I want you to know who the hell you're fighting with. Mm. Everyone must share the truth. I'll go first. He's holding this movie down right now, Brev. The region by the And backstory for all of them, all right. So the choice of whether or not to vote for independence from the realm would be obvious. Damn, that armor is bloody wall sick. I refused, and my ship was shut down. Crawling from the wreckage, we fought the forces of the mother world till our guns were dry. His story. I knew my men were... This is bloody well deep, mate, all right? My men's lives for the surrender of my own. I begged for mercy from the regent to spare them. But mercy is not known to the regent Balisarius. Blasting down. For the cannon. To punish me. My men were executed Ooh. before my eyes. Damn. A decision to defend. Them visuals are well sick. And his story is kind of low key deep, mate. How my surrender betrayed their courage and condemned them to their fate. No wonder he hates them, innit? Proper, mate. When the ships appeared in the sky above my world, I looked to my tribal elders for how we would respond. Mm. They cowered, submitting and giving them everything because they were too scared to fight. Her story is kind of like the main character's story, a little bit, just played out differently, obviously, innit? Never existed. Shooting them all down, easy life. It's weird, like, first of all, again, the visuals are really good. It's weird that we're getting the backstories for them in part two. Kind of would have liked that in part one a little bit. Do you know what I'm saying? Am I tripping? Tell me down below what you think, man. The Imperium troops slaughtered everything and everyone. Basically, their story is all kind of the same. The, these arseholes came and nuked everyone, and now they hate them, innit? I had never killed before. Never spilled blood. Until I spilled my own. Damn. Get that network great. My pen became rage. That, my rage that was the chain revenge yeah 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 okay okay nemesis i like that man my blood awakened them they showed me how she to... is the sickest character next to the robot Annie hopkins dude in it but i just wish it was rated r mate because even there like just as it like chopped her arm off the camera like you know did the little cutaway thing but it would have been just a little bit better in Rated R, man. But again, the rumour is it's coming. If you know it's coming, tell me down below. That'd be sick as well. Boy doesn't become a man until his father dies. And a prince becomes a king. Man's there grieving with Buckbeak. Visuals are sick. I don't care, man. Nice. They all have the exact same backstory. It's fine. Brings them together on it. But I just wish you would have seen this in part one. It would have really slapped a little bit better in my useless nerd opinion, man. Well said. We'll drink to that. The village is ready. Good. Mm. Whatever handful of officers they send down to collect the grain, we take them. Mm. With all our strength in the field, with no mercy. No mercy, mate. That's what I want to see. Come on. You see to it that the dropship is still in working order and first thing in the morning hidden from view. I will. All right, plans ready. Let's do this, man. Ah, yeah, they are here, mate. Just 
yeah, that's the Saturn-ish looking planet that's next to me, but damn, the visuals be slapping, bruv, as they did in part one. Probably the best thing in part one, the visuals. <laughs> Hello, James. Just chilling there, mate. Oof, that looks well freaky, mate, with that bloody crown on. The last person who called me that was the old commander of the Mechanicus Militarium, as he died in my arms. Oh, I'm sorry. It's all right. I like the way it sounds. It makes me feel something other than hopelessness. Mm, well, we could use your hand. Do you know what I mean? Loyalty to a king I cannot serve, and love for a child I could not save. But the sound of that name, as you say it, lets me feel, even in the smallest way, why I exist at all. Yeah, mate. James, we need you, mate. I know only that the thought of her being hurt or destroyed opened a part of me mm. that had been closed. Oof. Voice acting. Hopkins, a legend, mate. Understand, there are nightmares you and I fighting together. Mm. Not because we're ordered or commanded, but to defend something we love. James, you better get a rifle and just start. You must know, on, mate. you cannot win. Cheers. Thanks for that, mate. All set. <sighs> Big boy ship has arrived. Dreadnought. Alright, let's do this. Final battle, mate. Certainly not the plans of a farmer. Mm. Seems General Titus hasn't drunk away his wits just yet. Look here. Thermal imaging shows clusters of people in the long house at the top of the village. I love they got this. No doubt they're women and children. Hmm, good. We'll do our best to forestall a pitch battle in the village. While I negotiate, we'll dispatch the Cryptaea to capture the women and children. Mm. We'll land a small contingent of armor, but we won't need it when they see blades at the throat of their most vulnerable. Oh, they got plans on. We'll see how motivated they are to fight. All right, let's do this, please, man. Please, please, please. I'm getting ready for it. You know what I mean? Ooh, there's a lot of them. How are they going to stop all of them, bro? It's bare them, fam. Yeah, they can't stop all them. Surely not, man. They must have some sick plan, innit? Please, please, please be good. Mate, they dropped off tanks and people and they're gonna get battered, mate. Surely. This is literally like farmers with a couple guns and some elite squad against an actual army. <laughs> There is a lot of men, boy. No village welcome, no? Where's my warm embrace? Hm. Never given that cup of ale, you know? I'm surprised he's so chill. She killed you, bruv. <laughs> the same thing as the last time we met. I kill you. <laughs> yeah, simple. Yes. Not an uh, honor. Show, show the chest, come on. There it is. A seat in the Senate is what you seek, I would imagine. It's what I deserve. I am the Senate! You leave the villagers unharmed, and report to Belisarius that the warriors you sought evaded capture. And I should take nothing, yes? Nothing at all. You take your lives. Mm. This is your choice. Disgrace and relegation. Or your head cleaved from your shoulders. Your ship Shh. serving as your tomb. Your families and all of the mother world to know that you were slaughtered by the peasants of Belt. She better hope, yeah, that she pulls this off after that speech, bruv. You think I don't know you're hiding your women and children? As you stand here talking to me, your plan is already failing. You don't know about the grains. I could take the grain you offered. Sneaky bugger's got a side mission going on, innit? Brother Lear, surrender to me. And I will permit the villagers to live. 
However, if you refuse, those this village holds most dear, the elderly, the children. Little man's got his little blade. Let's go, my G. Has enough blood not been spilled in that beautiful building already? They must know that. Like. Cora, what are you doing? I thought so. And you go and say goodbye to your friend. This has to be the plan. It must be the plan. Huh? What's happening, huh? This is a bluff, isn't it? Yeah? Must be. I won't allow this place to die for me. I know what I'm doing. He's lying to you. Just let me go. No. Just let me go! Yeah, that, that was a bit too extreme. It's got to be a bluff thing, isn't it, man? No. no! No! Maybe it wasn't a bluff. Maybe she was being legit serious, bro. <laughs> Come on, boys. Hello. <laughs> Damn, boy, that's an explosion, mate. Oh, yeah, of course, the slow mo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was sick. That was very, very, very sick. This battle, please, give me hope. Come on, man. Come on. You're our only chance. You're our only chance, but you nearly effed it up. Proper, mate. Superhero or villain landed, I guess. He's moving like Shao Kahn, mate. Just cutting people down, snapping necks. Hey, hey, Shabby, Shabby, you need to get out of there immediately. Lift off! We need to lift off now! Get trying to go. They've had enough. See ya. The farmers are dangerous. Man's gonna do the run. Dive in there. Okay, now. Nah. I'll take that back. Chuck some grenades in. That is even better, to be honest. Oh, damn. Yes. Get out of here, mate. Yep, ladies and gentlemen. This is what I came to see, mate. Get that whole team like Blade, mate. Let's go, man. Yes. This is doing bits now. The slow mo again. <laughs> Proper slow mo, but the visuals are really good, man. Yeah, yeah, we definitely need rated arm. You know my man's leg got chopped off there, doesn't it? Noises at a gun. Woo! Yeah, she done that. Let's go, man. <laughs> I want the little man with the blade to do something. That, that's all I want to see now. Yeah, I bet they hate him. He's the traitor, isn't it? Pew, pew, pew. I love the noises, man. Damn. Gotcha. This guy's moving crazy now. He's had enough. <laughs> I don't know about a one on one with him, bro. Nah, this ain't it for you, bro. Get out of here, shut up, mate. There's no chance, man. Yeah. Nope. Brother. You should not have gotten that shit. You should not have gotten that shit. I can't even speak. Yeah. No blood. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's deep. It's good. I like the scene a lot. Him falling off. Very sick. I'm glad that the villain got a dub. Because I'm about the villain life. You know what I mean? But, again, ladies and gentlemen, rated R. Don't want to even take him. Rated M and see his entire jugular just spraying everywhere. That would have... That would have hit a little bit different, man. Will drop into formation. This so far is pretty good. The battle side of stuff. He's gonna chuck a grenade? Surely not. 
<laughs> oh, he's got something. <laughs> okay, he's not throwing it. Cool. What's the plan here? I don't even know, man. That ship is taking damage. Oh. And my instruments are not responding. Okay, you know what? That is pretty clever. I like that. The time has come. Oh, yeah, for mate. all that you love, for your yeah. home, protect each other, and show them no mercy. Prime injury. I hope I never see battle. Do you know what I mean? I ain't built for it. But if I had to go battle, I want that speech. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, they got the rifles versus semi uh, the fully autos. It just ain't it the same, man. To fight and die. Yeah! Not the die bit, but yeah, fight, yeah. <laughs> Come on, Kratos. <laughs> Taking on three of them at the same time. Oh, didn't see that coming. Shit. Come on, little man. Do something. <laughs> yes, brother. <laughs> One arm, one sword now. Yes. Oh, damn. My man, step it up. He's like, you know what? F it. I'm going to do it myself. This is pretty good. I can't lie. Music's pretty good as well. My man. He's the MVP, in it? Clean, bruv. And where's that stupid James with that stupid crown? Where's he at? Come on. Damn. He's about to detonate himself. Oh, damn. Huge explosion. This is really clever, Loki. Didn't think they were going to do that. Little sneaky infiltration. Where's, where's my man with a little sword, man? Little knife. Come on, brother. Quick time now. Let's go. Yes. Should have got me the balls, but whatever. <laughs> Yes, there you go. Fatality. That whole scene was actually pretty good. It's a shame about her, though. She kind of got a little bit battered. Then again, there was three of them, though, so, yeah. Hmm. That was a little bit sweet. Yeah. I saw that, by the way. How the laser bounced off the ground. That was pretty sick. Got that max pain action. Pew! Say what you want, I don't care. Zack Snyder can make anything look sick. <laughs> They've done it though, to be fair. Light work. It wasn't that bad. Damn! Just massacred everything with that stupid big ass tank. Yeah, there's no way, man. There's no way. They can't do nothing. Stable. It pulses out there. Uh, I'm not seeing ones either, but there's more blood. Surprise, mother! Pew, 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 pew! Wait, that's not. That's not... <laughs> Here you go. Kill them all! Yes. This, that, that, sorry. The infiltration thing, it's pretty cool. Oh yeah. Yep, that. 
They're all toast. Proper. I low-key forgot about her. What's she saying now, man? She's gonna be the one to take out that big-ass tank. Jesus! That tank crawler spider thing is a real problem, man. <laughs> He's got a blade in the mouth. Splinter cell. Yeah, take that thing out quick time now. Yes, there we go. Sick. Mega slow mo, damn. She just booted him into the fire, you know. Setting back up, what is the nature and number of the intruders? There are shots fired. Are... Don't worry about that, brother. Send everyone. <laughs> What's going on? There is a. Better get down there, bro. He better get down there. Sir, we've lost contact with the. They're getting ready to just. Oof. Shoot that big man cannon from the dreadnought, innit? All available security personnel, report to engine room. I need a nothing, now! He's going down here by himself. <laughs> and him. <laughs> yeah, we need rated R, man. Real bad. <laughs> Doing it. I'm going. Go, 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 I'm go, going. Go, go. <laughs> Come on, Kratos. <laughs> yeah, you can tell. They filmed certain bits with blood and gore, decapitations. They got another big man team coming. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Thing. I thought that was them deleted just then. Ooh. He's alive. He's awake. He's here. They've been building this up, yeah? He better kill everyone instantly for him. Man is standing in the middle like the final boss. This is what I came to see. Come on. Is he punching them all? He's, he's punching them. I can't tell, but it looks like their guns ain't doing jack shit, mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is what I need to see. Shitting out. He's on a mission. Let's go, bruv. Oh, mate, it's a bad day for you lot. <laughs> See you later, mate. Man just jumped out like he's Superman. Yeah, they saved him to the end. All right. I see, I see what you're doing, Zach. Man's got that super mega landing. Let's go. Man, hit him with a nod. Turn his red kill switch fucking eyes off. Hold up, my only one complaint is I wish you would have done that earlier, bro. <laughs> They're about to shoot him down. Sorry. She better hurry up, you know. Always seen. This is pretty dope, man. <laughs> They're about to turn everything into nothing. <laughs> oh, time, man. Here we go. Final round, fight. Make a better ballad when I slay you in battle. You've done well to get this far. You can't lose twice, innit? Man better do something, you know. 
not that I'm rooted for them, but it's a little bit embarrassing. You lose two, two and oh is a bit too much. Fire at will. Damn, glad we saw the explosion. Holy hell, boy. Mission accomplished for them lot, innit? Take her. My man! Oh, you just got... Oh, fuck. <laughs> They're gonna fight as the ship crashes it down. Oh, mate! Yes! This was one of the finale. Lightsaber jewel, baby. He's still fighting as they're falling, damn. <laughs> this is pretty cool, I can't lie, man. Ooh, hit him with a drop kick, baby. That face he just, he just break his neck, brother. <laughs> Okay, nah. He's cool. Neck is stronger than I thought it was. <laughs> that sword is gone. Ah, or is it? Alright, I see that little setup. I knew it. I knew, yeah. As soon as he started running, we're getting some mega slow mo, man. It's a bit too far away to grab the sword, isn't it? Stop. Open your eyes! Stop. Open your eyes! Yeah, he's moving mad, you know. <laughs> My man saved her. Hold well on, mate. Technically, she would have been fatality then, to be fair, isn't it? So. I guess we can say it's 1-1 one, one now, so next film we get the third film. Then. Okay, never mind. Yeah. He's perma dead now. That's it. We definitely need rated R, Zach. Come on now, drop it, baby. Yes. He escaped, mate. Yeah, the whole ship's coming down. The visuals are very good. I think the visuals are actually better than in this one then part one mate. <laughs> he took a bad blast though, innit? Like, I'm surprised he's still alive to be honest. I, I spoke too soon man. He has to die innit? to make the story do you know what I mean? <laughs> You've done. You saved us. Mm. All of us. I wish they would have built the love stuff up a little bit more and we'd feel it a little bit more. <laughs> he did save her though, to be fair, so. And you. Right, back up has arrived, ladies and gentlemen. Yes. My man came in clutch. Love the camera angles. Give me more. This is pretty good. Pretty good last battle. I'll, I'll, I'll be real. Yes, just wipe him out, mate. They're trying to escape. Not on my watch. <laughs> they went quite hard on this last slight little third act. It's pretty good, man. Yay! The traitorous bugger he got what he wanted in the end. Woo! <laughs> it's really over. It's. Do you know what else is over? Him. R.I.P. My man. Damn. The visuals. Woo. All of you. Honor the fallen. You honor my brother and his bravery. 
Do not speak of me when you speak of honor and bravery. Ugh. I've lied to you. Don't worry about it, man. You literally saved everyone. Don't worry about it. Titus. I know, child. Yeah, of course he knows, man. You know that I'm Arthur Laius, Adopted daughter of the region Belisarius. And the assassin of the Princess Issa. I know your name. Yes. Mm. My man, best in the sh bloody show, movie, both movies, best character, mate, easily. We're not her assassin. Mm. For the princess is still alive. You thought she could be killed so easily? Mm. No. She's more than that. More than meets the eye. <laughs> you have a reason now, do you not? To fund her and to fight? If you do choose to fight, I will stand with you. Yeah, all of them are, of course. Saved everyone. Is my man hinting at part three, bruv? As far as I'm aware, there is no part three happening, but the way this is ending, I'm open to it. I see it, like, you know what I mean? You used to fight with us, Roma. Mm. I'd find this lost princess. If what you say is true, and the princess lives, I have no choice. Yes. I serve the line of the slain king. It is my honor to fight. Part three is inbound. When's it happening, Zach? Come on, bruv. To fight her. Mm, to fight. To fight. Yes, part three is definitely coming, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> That's it. He's gonna end now, yeah. Yeah. Zach. Cheeky Snyder. <laughs> I low key just had a little peek. Just to see if there's any after credits, but uh, there ain't, man. All right, let's um, have a chat and a review, mate. Gonna do it a little bit different. I'm gonna start with the things I liked, then dislike, and then my score out of 10. First of all, the things I liked, the best thing, the visuals. They were better than part one. And part one was pretty good. Zack Snyder, as always, though, he brings the hard visuals. But that with the sound, laser guns, swords, space, and the explosions were very, very good. I would say nearly at the top level of being very sick. Especially for Netflix, no disrespect, you know what I mean? But sometimes they, they rein the budget in a little bit, man, because it's not a big, like, movie theoretical release. I'm pretty certain I said that wrong, but you know what I mean. The characters were actually a little bit better, but not all of them. It kind of leans into a negative, if I'm being honest. Um, but we'll, we'll talk about them in a minute. The characters I liked, the MVP, bruv. His backstory was real deep, real, real sick. James, finally, thank God, bro, after they teased us, mate, <laughs> in part one. And they teased us for about three quarters of part two. But my man, he saved the day. I wish I would have just started with him. And in fact, for movie three, just let him do his thing. He's fucking bulletproof. He can't be stopped, mate. He annihilated them so easily. Just send him off. In fact, don't even call it Rebel Moon. Just call it Rebel James. Easy, mate. There you go, Zach. Uh, you're welcome, bro. Cora was better in this movie than the other one. Nemesis was a little bit better as well. She had way more time to shine. But however, Buckbeak, I don't know his name, the Buckbeak dude and the, 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 the girl with the thing, she, they didn't really do much, man. But I guess... They limited it. They had, I don't know if they had more to do in episode one, but maybe it's about the same. And the final act was very, very good. I like the battle a lot. It paid off, man. Thank God it paid off. And uh, that tease for three was pretty nice as well. However, the things I disliked, story was kind of a mess. Some of the dialogue was pretty atrocious. And the crops, yeah, bruv, allow that. There was so much filler, kissy stuff, lying in bed, explaining, and the crops... God, I don't want to see crops ever again, mate, in any movie, please. Just way to use, and it felt like it was done to stretch out the overall thing to make it two movies. That's how I feel. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. And then, trust me, if you're watching this, you're at this point in the video, I cut a lot of it out for YouTube, so. And the final question before the review, was it better than part one? For me, definitely better than part one. Uh, I think together, I don't really know if they like amplifies, but score-wise, for me... This might seem harsh, but I'm going to go 5.5 out of 10. A little better than average. It was leaning towards the side slowly of a good. Like, a 6 out of 10 for me is a good movie that I probably will watch again. I don't know if I'm going to rush to watch this again ever, if I'm being totally real, but 
it's better than average, man. And I liked it a lot better than episode one. Thank you for watching part one, whatever. Thanks for watching, guys. Tell me your score down below. You guys are the best. See you on a bit. Maybe for part three, if it gets made. Maybe they're like waiting to see how this does. But it looks like they're making part three. But yeah, I'll see you there. Peace.